Shelton Benjamin's luck. Feel so sorry for the guy. Hyped up to announce to be returned on SmackDown. And we're waiting for him to come on to SmackDown. Because it's been a long time since we've seen Shelton Benjamin. Sure, we got Rhino, but it's Rhino. And we got Jinder Mahal returning, which just came out of nowhere. But that's Jinder Mahal. But the one name that got us hyped up so much is Shelton Benjamin. Because that guy, oh my God, that guy. How old is he? In his 40s, 30s, late 30s? Looks like he's still in his 20s. Hasn't aged a bit. Announced to return to SmackDown. We were all celebrating. It's a celebration, bitches! But then he gets a rotator cuff injury. Fuck. Of all the things, man. About all the things. I was looking forward to Benjamin coming back. But now that he may be out for a couple of months, who knows how long he'll be out for. But what a way to come back, though. At least he's not Kevin Nash and got injured inside the ring by running one step and falling to the floor. Will we ever let Kevin Nash let go of that joke? Will we ever let him go? No, not really. But this is Sheldon Benjamin. It sucks for him. Sucks for us too, but hey, let's see what else. who else is coming back to SmackDown or Raw. The draft is only two weeks old so far, so we still got a bunch of other people who may show up. But yeah, Shelton Benjamin, like, has the worst luck here. Being announced to return to SmackDown, then gets an injury. They don't really even say how long it's going to be out for, but hey, that sucks. That just sucks. But anyways, that's what's going on with Shelton Benjamin. What do you guys think of this shitty thing that happened to him? Anyways, take it easy, Humanoid Nation. Humanoid freak out. Bye.